The Federal Ministry of Health and Social Welfare said the current administration is working to improve cancer treatment affordability in Nigeria. Speaking at a national symposium on cancer genomics, precision oncology care and precision community health for black populations, the Permanent Secretary Ministry of Health, Daju Kacholum, revealed that this will be done through the Cancer Health Fund program. Here is the rest of the news. With the rising burden of cancer in Nigeria in 2021, the Nigerian government introduced Cancer Health Fund, followed by the National Strategic Cancer Control Plan 2023-2027 to and proposed the upcoming National Cancer Research Agenda 2024-2028. to Speaking at a symposium in Abuja, the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Health, Daju Kachulom, emphasized that preventive measures are key to reducing cancer incidence in the country. There is a very strong political will from the highest level. The President, Her Excellency the First Lady, the Ministers and the entire management of the Federal Ministry of Health that we need to provide access to affordable and quality cancer treatment, research and care for our citizens. And we would do that. We are not resting. As the Federal Ministry of Health, we are working to see how we can reduce the burden. That is why we have the Cancer Health Fund. The Cancer Health Fund is one of such that the Federal Ministry of Health has brought about to reduce the burden of cancer care. But I would suggest that we as Nigerians begin to have early detection. You go for checkups regularly. And I know we have a problem of human resources for health. What the Federal Ministry of Health is doing presently is that we are training 120,000 frontline health workers to help in the primary health care centers to provide the care. The Director General of the National Institute for Cancer Research and Treatment, Professor Usman Malami Aliyu, stated that the launched five-year National Strategic Plan for Cancer Control 2023-2027 to is aimed to improve cancer awareness, screening, research, and establish new treatment centers across Nigeria over the next five years. We are currently at the pilot phase where we have passed that one we are uh, we've graduated to a more uh, robust implementational scale but you can't do that without getting more funds and that is what NIGRAD is currently doing uh, to rejig remodel the whole uh, structure of the cancer health fund so that more centers can benefit currently we have there are about six centers that are benefiting patients can go there and get some form of treatment cutting across uh, chemotherapy, radiotherapy, and some other uh, drugs made uh, modification. Hopefully by next year, more centers are going to come off, if not all the centers in the country. The Executive Director, Mayo Clinic Cancer Programs, Cheryl Wilman, called for community-based screening for cervical, breast, and prostate cancers. She stressed the need for vaccinating against HPV virus to prevent cervical cancer. We think early cancer screening for the entire Nigerian population is so important. There are several cancers that we can detect very early through community-based screening programs. Cervical cancer and vaccination against the virus that causes cervical cancer. Early screening for breast cancer. Early screening for prostate cancer treatment of hepatitis which causes liver cancer so there are very many things we can do in communities across nigeria for the nigerian population that prevent these early cancers at the very beginning other experts called on nigerians to adopt habits that lower their risk of cancer and to strengthen primary care as part of a comprehensive strategy we're here today because of NIGRIDE's five-year cancer control plan. We're interested in identifying new partnership opportunities, opportunities for investment, for them to achieve the intended goals over the next five years. What we expect is that there will be partnership opportunities both on the research side but also on the clinical side to scale clinical trials, to have new project opportunities happening both with cancer centers in the United States and with the NICRITE partners here in, in Nigeria as well. We are going to have clear, actionable agenda that focuses on research, 
that focuses on building research capacity, training of people, really engaging people from the community. Because if you are going to solve issues of cancer, it's not from the top down. You also have to have from the bottom up. There are different communities in Nigeria that have not been engaged. So we're going to have that. So there are going to be action items um, that we're going to have. Three-year goals, five-year goals, 10-year goals. And we, we continue to measure how are we achieving those goals to make sure that we are successful in what we do. The symposium discussed ways to strengthen prevention, detection, and treatment of cancer across Nigeria through coordinated public health efforts and innovative solutions.